that was really surprising for me that uh, the whole families or the whole villages are collecting money to make it possible for those workers to come to Poland. The first uh, thing what, which was uh, really surprising for me and that enabled me to create um, a new category of workers, which I call uh, free slaves, was that people who are already in Poland, they are really not able to make uh, any um, decision uh, connected with their work. So uh, their uh, labor situation is really dependent on uh, what the employer wants to do. What is especially detrimental uh, in this, let's say, um, migration regime, if you want, is the forced dependence of migrants on certain employers or, or um, uh, work agencies, um, which makes it much more difficult for migrants themselves to what you could say vote with their feet. So if they don't like it at a certain with a certain employer, that they can leave and just pick up another employment. This is often not possible, at least not legally uh, possible, and this really makes migrants much more vulnerable. In the illegal way, they are migrating uh, so that they are not getting whatever uh, they, they are said to be get uh, according to the contract, because they always get lower than the contract, low ways, and also the working condition is not good and um, uh, very um, uh, that there is very uncertain access to the this residency permanent residency